I thought I would film a week in my life because I started my second year of graduate school at Chapman. So my week basically starts on a Tuesday. I have two classes. The first is my pre-production class. So we're getting ready to film my pilot in the next semester. So we have to do all the prep this semester, um, which has been really fun. And then after that, we have our thesis class, which we write a full length pilot, a different pilot. So we're gonna do that today. It's still 80 degrees, but it's October. So this class I'm going to, I said I was prepping to film my pilot. Let me tell you what it is. My pilot is called The Nightmare Diaries. It's premise is basically two strangers have nightmares of each other and it's like the girl dreams of the guy murdering her and the guy dreams of him murdering the girl so they go to a sleep therapist who tells them to write down all their nightmares in a journal and then they bump into each other on the street they're freaked out because they didn't think you know they were real so they switch diaries and try to figure out why this is happening through clues that they dreamed of it's pretty cool it's not supernatural it ends up being an evil sleep therapist so the point i'm at now i've written the script we get eight pages like as a proof of concept of a full pilot and then the school gives us five thousand dollars to film it this weekend i just signed on a director which i'm excited for i'm going to class today and i think we're gonna be making the casting call in class because you have to post it on a website and you have to give little character descriptions and everything so the actors can sign up to audition so that will be fun which probably means we're gonna start casting in the next couple weeks and then the class like right after that i probably have five minutes in between where i wrote my act one of my other pilot which is basically i turned my book into a tv show like the book i already wrote it's in my description if you haven't seen that soulmate and i just wrote the first act which i'm gonna get notes on today which is stressful because my teacher hates it <laughs> she's a comedy writer she wrote for friends she doesn't like you know ya drama cw type shows so everyone else loves it so i don't really give a fuck yeah my class is from freaking 10 a.m to basically the other one ends at 4 class I figured out I'm shooting on the first weekend of February so now I can start planning everything <laughs> and then my homework is to make a casting call which is what I thought so I need the character breakdowns and then I need my casting director to put it on backstage and see if anyone auditions and then in my other class she went over my act one and gave me some notes so I have to rewrite that it shouldn't be a lot I think I just need to add like two scenes and a couple dialogue words but yeah usually the rest of the day <laughs> I relax because tomorrow I have my internship and I have to leave at 7 a.m. so I try to sleep at like 9 10 p.m. I just got back from dinner with my friends the theme of my dinner was you can't fight delusion <laughs> you can't argue with someone who thinks the world revolves around them you just can't it's 10 p.m. I'm gonna go to bed because I have to wake up at I have to leave at 7 and then I'll tell you about my internship on the two-hour drive <laughs> it's dark outside <laughs> fall semester i'm interning at voltage pictures they're a production company who did the hurt locker they do all the after movies and like those fan fiction turned into movies movies like the one with dylan sprout and it's funny because when i was like 11 on wattpad i was reading the after books by anna todd like when she was working on her first one i think i started like maybe when she's on chapter 20 something. So to work at the production company that is making those into movies is all circle. But if anyone is mad at those movies, I started working after they released, okay? Basically every day I have a script and a book that I'm just working on all day. I read it and then I see what's wrong with it, if it's good, if it can make a good TV show or movie. And then I give those notes to my boss. And then there's also days where I get to watch like a, a cut 
of a movie that's coming out and give notes on that. There's intern Zooms every Friday to, to check in and then there's also script meetings every Friday where we meet with the CEO <laughs> and tell him about all the scripts we read and why we shouldn't make them or should make them. We also get to give notes on scripts that they've already like agreed to produce. The environment of each production company I've worked with is so different. Like <laughs> they're either best friends or they are colleagues. This is not my freaking day. Leave early <laughs> to get breakfast and I'm 30 minutes late without breakfast. And then I'm so hungry by the time lunch comes around, which is one, but I have to cover reception while the receptionist takes lunch. And she literally takes a two hour lunch, two hours. And this is another intern, it's not a worker. So I'm literally, it's three now. And I'm just gonna eat for the first time. I'm home. This looks extremely orchestrated, but I came home to flowers from my boyfriend. Oh, I'm such a simple girl. My whole mood has changed. It's Friday. We're doing my internship again. I have a priority script that needs to get done today. And then I have another book. Do I say hi to my vlog? <laughs> hey vlog. Hey guys. It's literally Sunday. I'm on my way to go surfing. Oh. Yesterday my high school friend was in town so she came by to my apartment for the first time because I usually just see her when I'm home. Me and Sophia haven't been surfing in a long time. We used to go every weekend and then we got robbed. I think we were a little traumatized. <laughs> and I also tried to get out of it today. I don't know. I just have this like weird feeling but she was like get out of bed. <laughs> We bought a lock that you can like put on your car. I also need to do all of my homework today. All of it. Like what? This is such perfect surfing conditions. We surfed. I literally, did I do any work yesterday? No, I woke up at 7 a.m. today and finished a rewritten act one of my script. And now I'm on my way to the set to help a director out with some background actors. But it's set in 2002 and it was cocktail attire. So I'm wearing a really pretty dress, which is gonna make me feel more awkward. It's literally under this. <laughs> but I did convince my friend to help, so I'm gonna meet them there. <laughs> 